up everybody Russ with rwgresearch.com so I always wanted to try something which is fly in the wind on a ridge but I don't really have many ridges today though I have a lot of wind so we're currently at the fly field I wanted to actually bring you here to show you just how windy it actually is so God bless America our flags out there let's go check I'm gonna take my hat off is whipping like crazy. Our wind sock over there is going like crazy. The flag up there is going like, well, wind sock is going like crazy. So, I'm actually going to go try to fly over the dam, which is actually over there. You probably can't hear me because it's too windy. So, according to the map, it's about 25 knots today. Blowing in the correct direction, which is up the bowl over there where the dam is so I'm gonna go over there and we're gonna try flying now I've actually done this this will be the third time going out the first time I didn't know if it was possible the wind was okay the second time the wind was perfect and it was amazing and so I'm gonna get some good footage of today because it's perfect wind today normally you don't fly on a day like this they say it's a bad day to fly RC I'm gonna redirect that to you just got to find the right location and the right craft let's go see if we can get this done Oh boy! Lily, it's raining. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Look, literally this puff right above us is raining. Yeah, there's a little cloud. And the cloud went poof and now all this is coming down on us. Oh, it's like, it's like super bright. That's it's not that windy right now. I want it to be really windy, so we might have to wait for it to get windier. But for now, we're out here, me, Riley, and Lily. Let's go up to the top and see how windy it is up there, because... Probably really windy up there. <laughs> yeah, there's a rain cloud. It's hilarious. <laughs> Let me get up. Let me help her. So it's really weird to see the airplane flying into the wind but yet gaining speed. It's pretty cool. I did this for quite some time and uh, got a little squirrely here and there. I think the wind wasn't very turbulent during this operation. But uh, yeah, I don't know. It's just pretty cool. It's something I've been wanting to do for a long time. In fact, I bought some gliders a year before this and never got them out because I never got the opportunity but during this time of the season of this year around May, April, in that time frame it gets really windy and you can't go out to the normal fly field so 
figured I'd try some soaring, um, some ridge soaring. So using the wind coming up the hill, the glide ratio isn't um, isn't low enough to where you can still basically glide into the wind and gain forward momentum, even though the wind's blowing at you. And uh, it, you can see how slow it is to go to the left. The wind was blowing kind of to the right here, so it goes a lot faster to the right, and it takes a lot more effort to get it back to the left, but it does work. Um, generally, in, then, in this type of soaring, you want to get some speed and kind of carry it left and then carry it right. But the way the wind was blowing today, it was blowing a little bit too far to the right, so it wasn't coming straight at me. So it was really hard to get back to the left. But I did this for a while. There's quite a bit of footage here. And uh, I'll just cut to some of the good, interesting parts. But yeah, I was out here for quite a long time and didn't use my motor at all and just used the wind. It's quite, quite interesting. In the future, I try some dynamic soaring where things go catastrophically wrong. So uh, yeah. You'll want to see that. It was pretty funny. Anyway, I'll just let the video play out. Enjoy.
right, so here I decided I was going to try to catch this thing. Um, I'm standing basically right at the edge of the ridge, and right at about where I'm standing, it appears to get slightly turbulence coming over the hill, because or slightly less air pressure going up, which makes sense because I'm standing on a flat spot. But um, I try to bring it to me, and it just kind of doesn't want to stay there, so I just keep trying to bring it to me, and it just doesn't want to stay. It just keeps wanting to float around. So I spend some quite a bit of time trying to catch this thing. Eventually, I figured out you just kind of have to bring it far right and kind of swing it back around and just perfectly catch it. But I spent quite a bit of time just sitting right here at the edge trying to get it.
Is it Wendy? You gotta speak up. Yes! She says Wendy. <laughs> Away, we better go get it. Down there somewhere. On the back side of the ridge, it's like barely even windy over here. There she is, totally fine. It's crazy how there's like no wind right on this side. Uh -huh. Like right here, it's even pretty calm, but like right under the edge, is nothing. Yep. All right, well, did you have fun? Yeah. We tried to put that giant battery in that plane when we and Riley both built the first plane. Tried to fly it for a really long time. We just flew for like the same amount of time and I used like an ounce of energy. Can I stop Hilarious. This one's got a teeny tiny little battery in it. Oh, Bye. So yeah, here's a short clip of when I tried the dynamic soaring. Let's just say it was a lot windier and a lot crazier. Short little snippet probably take a little time to get this because I got some other things to try to do to make this video awesome but check out this crazy wind Well, God bless you guys. Have a good day. Read the Bible more as always, and uh, let me know what you think. Got any ideas out there of what to do on a windy day on this ridge? Do tell. Do tell. Peace out.